This is the concept for a human power tilting reverse trike. Two wheels in front, one in back. They can transition between steering by leaning and non-leaning normal steer like a car. Steering by leaning works by tilting the wheels and body of the bike while the front wheels are free to cast or to the proper steering angle for the angle of lean and speed using gyroscopic effect. Steering is done via a steering wheel that connects to the lead steer mechanism, shown in green, through a shaft with universal joints that allow it to move with the leaning body and connects to the steering lean mechanism through gears mounted on the non-tilting subframe. The subframe maintains parallel to the ground and the front wheels and leaning body are attached to it. Basic operation would be while stopped, the vehicle is locked in non-lean normal steer mode. A hand lever unlocks the lean mechanism and engages the pedals of the bike to the lean mechanism through a clutch, cables, and guide wheels. Pedaling forward propels the vehicle forward while transitioning you to the free to caster mode by winching a connecting bar, dark blue, from a point close to the lean mechanism's axis to its top, thus changing the ratio of lean to steer input. At the same time the connecting bar is being raised, a cam is gradually loosening spring tension on a pitman arm, unlocking steering from the movement of the steering wheel, allowing the wheels to free caster. The pitman arm also acts as a tie rod with an Ackerman effect. When in free to caster mode, engaging the transition clutch and pedaling backwards transitions to normal steer while pedaling has no effect on the motion of the bicycle. The use of the steering wheel will require that braking must be done by pushing the steering wheel forward using a balancing disc to disperse the pressure evenly through cables to brakes on all three wheels. This concept shows leading arm front suspension on the front wheels that will most likely not be included due to weight considerations and will have to wait until the motorcycle powered version. It also shows a dampened spring assist for the transition to normal steer. On a motorcycle, this would be hydraulic and would power the transition between normal steer and free to caster.